I remember, uh, you know, when I broke this shackle and I started writing. See, it goes down to childhood when I made that sketch and people said, make more. I was, then confidence came. Now, when that happened and I joined Rajkumar Hirani, sir, on Lagero Munna Bhai. He was trying to write a scene and there's this old age home and those, you know, old people. He was trying to crack a scene there. I said, sir, I'm going to write a scene. I'll write this scene. He said, okay, write it, bring it tomorrow. Okay, whole day I sat, night I sat, I wrote that scene. Next day I came to him, I took out a printout and I gave it to him. My scene was nine pages. He's like, what is this? I said, sir, script, scene. Hai. He's like, how many pages? pages I said, nine. He looked at me and he went through the scene. He said, you've written, a, you've written well, but this scene has to be two pages. Maximum two and a half pages, not more than that. Now, you rewrite the scene and bring it down to two pages. So then again one day, and believe me, writing the nine pages was much more easier than bringing it down to two pages. How do I, you know, and crunch the thoughts, the theme of the scene in two, two minutes? That is the skill. But there's so much of self-learning involved. I wrote the scene again. Then he said, huh, finally, you've written a correct scene. But of course, I will not use it in the film. <laughs> but, but you learned something today. So I think there's a lot of learning. Uh, and, and see, write, you know, writing uh, is more about rewriting. I write my films very fast. I write it. Missed Call, I wrote in one night. Tulsidas Jr., I wrote in one month, my first draft. And I wrote it in 2009. I wrote my first draft of Tulsidas Jr. It was 102 pages. Trust me, from 2009 to 2018, almost 10 years, a decade of rewriting I've done. Because also my film was not getting made. So there was, every time I was like, Chalo, let me rewrite. But I, that film remained, 80% remained the same as my first draft. In that 10 years, of course, I did a lot of other things also and wrote other films, but I kept working, tweaking Tulsidas Jr. But I made maybe 20% changes. But that 20% is what made the film what it is also. The heart remained in its place, but those embellishments, you know, got it to its maximum potential. So, rewriting is also very important. When you write a story, you rewrite it. Then you rewrite it and it reaches there. Uh, the best of filmmakers, Ashutosh Govarikar sir, Rajkumar Hirani sir, these people, you will you, not believe the kind of rewriting they do. And they are not even, uh, they will not even brag about it. I have written 17 drafts. They are thinking now, when is the next draft I'm going to write? How I'm going to make it better? How I'm going to make it better? And till they don't have it on paper, till they don't lock it on paper, they will not go on floor. You, that's why you see, they will make great films, but they will make a film every three, four years, five years. Raju sir made a film after, you know, five years. Ashu sir is working on his next script. He's just relentlessly going on working on, on the script because he wants to make it, he wants to ensure that it's perfect. He took four years to make right Lagan. So, I think there's a lot of the discipline of writing and rewriting is what makes you a writer, ultimately. So, since we're saying uh, about uh, discipline of writing and rewriting, hmm. um, my question was like, how often do you improvise in sets? Because normally when we have shoots and when we have like, you know, small projects, we write like a rough sketch or rough sketch of uh, what we're going to do. Hmm. We always have this... Um, tsunami of thoughts and what we can do on set and we change the whole thing up. So have how often have you done that? Uh, or is it like you stay very strict to your written script? See, there are two types of filmmakers. Yeah. Uh, one is the kind that I am where I like to follow the script. I like to follow the word, the, what is written because I've written it over years and I'm very sure of what I have written. So, what I have uh, thought so much in a free time, sitting in a room alone, can't be wrong. You compare that to the... Right now, I'm on the set, I'm with 150, 120 people, I'm in the chaos, and I get a new thought. For me, I'm very... I don't want to take that risk. Because I would have had that thought while writing, and I would have negated it for some reason. So, I'm someone who follows the script, but yet, I do improvise in terms of, see, because 
इट्स अ कोलेबरेटिव प्रोसेस यू नो यू कांट बी लाइक मैं जो बोल रहा हूँ वही होगा नेवर आई मीन द ग्रेटेस्ट ऑफ फिल्म मेकर्स कीप द ईयर्स एंड द सेंसेज ओपन फॉर एनी सजेशन टू कम एक्टर्स हैव सजेशंस सिनेमाटोग्राफर्स ऑल योर एच ओ डीज हैव सजेशंस इवन द लाइट बॉय हैज अ सजेशन विच फिल्टर्स एंड यू नो विच कम्स थ्रू द एच ओ डी एंड कम्स टू यू ओनली टॉक टू योर एच ओ डीज इफ यू डोंट हैव द टाइम टू लिसन टू अ लाइट बॉय वो तो पिक्चर ही नहीं बनेगी सो यू टेक एवरी वन सजेशन टिल अ पॉइंट बट सम थिंग्स इट्स अ लॉट टू डू विद इंस्टिंग यू फील कि यार करता हूँ मैं एक टेक तो ऐसे लेता हूँ and it's happened in my while shooting tulsidas junior the last take would be ek take aisa leta hu let's see and that would become the take mm. so very small things if you seen the film uh, like in one of the scenes where rajiv kapoor sir uh, comes out of the, the the parents have an argument in the room both the boys are standing outside and rajiv kapoor comes out walks out of the uh, room and the mother is still shouting and uh, so in one of the last take in matlab the, the i think it was the fifth take rajiv kapoor stepped out of the room while she was talking he did this so at the heart of it i was like no man this is derogatory ye nahi kar sakte but when we went to the edit table it was amazing what he did it was, you can't recreate that you can't oh, that is magic that is the magic of cinema that happens in between all the chaos something magical happens and you feel ki nahi yaar ye rakhta hu main edit so i had a argument with the editor editor said nahi yaar ye thoda ajeeb hai derogate aise derogate nahi it's a it's a family yaar mazak bhi hota hai what even raju sir also does that uh, uh, ashu sir has done it in lagan lot of filmmakers do that to thoda masti rehta hai thoda ek that's what cinema is so you take those chances uh, uh, you know those certain but i am that kind of filmmaker who sticks to the script 90% and then there embellishment but then there's someone like a anurag basu sir who goes into a set thinking ki aaj pata nahi kya hone wala hai he does anything i mean that i have not been on his set but i've heard he makes his films on the set and he's a genius at it you know some people have that power ki aaj main aisa karta hu main isko ghuma deta hu isko pura aisa fir baad mein dekh lenge एडिटेबल पे देख लेंगे वो आई डोंट हैव दैट काइंड ऑफ गट्स कि बिकॉज आई एम वेरी स्क्रिप्ट ओरिएंटेड स्टोरी ओरिएंटेड कैरेक्टर्स शुड बी ए पॉइंट टू बी पॉइंट बी पॉइंट टू सी पॉइंट एंड सी आल्सो इट डिपेंड्स ऑन द जॉनर ऑफ द फिल्म यू आर मेकिंग यू नो इफ यू आर मेकिंग अ फिल्म लाइक बर्फी देन यू कैन टेक चांसेस यू नो यू डू क्रेजी थिंग्स यू सडनली थिंक ऑफ अ सीन इसको ऐसा गिरा देते हैं यहाँ से लेट एम टॉपल एंड फॉल यू नेवर रिटर्न यू जस्ट यू नो क्रिएट आउट ऑफ द ब्लू एंड देन दैट मैजिक comes transforms onto screen but then you know then like you lot of, you hear a lot about anurag sir that only he knows what he is making none of the kisi ke paas script nahi hai ko, hod ko bhi nahi pata ki kya ho raha <laughs> but then when you when it all comes together on the edit table you are like wow genius so i think it's to each its own you know it's i think it's a lot of lot to do with instinct what you feel then and it gets sharper over a period of time the more you shoot the more confident because the first time when you take a chance it's all about taking chances risk na you take a risk i'll do this on the set and you have the liberty of taking takes mm. in the time matlab you can take a third take for but when that risk work when that risk works on the edit table then you're like oh man i'll do more of this now i'll do it next time also so it, you you get better with time you know you get better i mean it goes wrong also sometimes but then that's what cinema is about you know you take your chances <laughs>